I'm um, uh, breaking news, guys. Breaking news. Nigerian billionaire Obi Kubana has just been spotted paying homage to his god, you know, to his juju. I'm um, uh, it's crazy. Here is the full video after this short intro. <laughs> Yo, good you guys and welcome back to the channel. This is Savage World. If this is your first time coming across our channel, do it to click that beautiful red subscribe button and like this video and drop a comment in the comment section. So, guys, on today's trending video, from the look of the topic, we are having the Nigerian biggest billionaire Obi Kubana on our video today. So, guys, the news is that Obi Kubana was spotted in his home, and inside his house, there is a image of a lion laid on the ground, and he is seen paying homage to it. To make progress. We value the things we treasure and we treasure the things we value. And this um, uh, guys, how are you guys feeling about this video? Do you guys think Obi Kubana is really into money rituals? Because the, the type of money this guy spends online, the type of money, as you can remember, doing his late mom's bury, as in he shut down everywhere, spraying bundles and bundles of cash. Um, uh, do you guys think this is wealth is from a genuine source or is into money rituals? Um, uh, it's crazy. It's even gotten to a point that the that the Economic Financial Crimes Commission, the EFCC, has even arrested him at a point and questioned the source of wealth. So guys, with this video being proof, do you guys think Obi Kubana is a ritualist or do you guys think it's into pure business money? Drop a comment in the comment section. I would like to know your opinion on this. Like this matter is getting out of hand. He has even gone on to sign portable with a deal of 50 million naira for his newly opened um, company Odugu Bidas. Um, uh, it's crazy for a newly opened company, he's paying portable for 50 million euro to just to advertise his company. And if you ask me, that's quite a lot of a lot of money for a newly opened business. Well, drop a comment in the comment section. Do you guys think his words is genuine or ingenuine? 